This is my Kamek Little Big Blue Electroacoustic Pedal Harp and it costs about $20,000. And this is my Harpsicle Flatsicle model Lever Harp which costs about $1,000. My Kamek pedal harp weighs about 70 pounds, and my harpsicle weighs about seven. <laughs> so there's a big difference there. I love my flat school lever harp because I can just kind of throw it on my shoulder and bring it wherever I'm going. I could bring it on vacation, I could bring it on an airplane, um, I could take it outside and not have to worry so much about the cold weather. With my Kamek pedal harp, I'm a lot more careful about where I take it. It's a lot harder to get upstairs, it's a lot harder to carry, I can't pick it up, and it's a lot more nerve-wracking to bring it out in cold weather. I actually have a clause in my performance contract that says I can't perform outside at gigs with this harp when the weather is too warm or too cold. I have a video on my channel about how much work it is to move this pedal harp. My Kamek is a pedal harp and my Flatsicle is a lever harp. Because there aren't levers on every string, you can only play in certain keys. If you want to know more about the difference between pedal and lever harps, I do have a video about that on my channel. Part of the reason why my Kamek pedal harp is so expensive is because it's electroacoustic and has built-in pickups. With my Flatsicle lever harp, if I ever wanted to amplify a performance, I'd have to install a pickup or purchase a microphone. The Flatsicle lever harp is a perfect choice for beginners or for harpists who want to travel easily with their harp. If you're getting more serious about gigging and performing professionally, a harp like the Kamek would be better suited for you. If you want to hear the difference in the sound quality, take a listen.